To unleash the full power of the federal government in this effort today, I am officially declaring a national emergency. Two very big words. The action I am taking will open up access to up to $50 billion of very importantly, very important and a large amount of money for states and territories and localities in our shared fight against this disease. In furtherance of the order, I'm urging every state to set up emergency operation centers effective immediately. You're going to be hearing from some of the uh, largest companies and greatest retailers and uh, medical companies in the world. They're standing right behind me and inside of me. I'm also asking every hospital in this country to activate its emergency preparedness plan so that they can meet the needs of Americans everywhere. The hospitals are very engaged. Uh, New York and various other places are also various engaged. I just spoke with Governor Cuomo. We had a very good conversation. And we're working very strongly with uh, many states, including New York. The emergency orders I'm issuing today will also confer broad new authority to the Secretary of Health and Human Services. The Secretary of HHS will be able to immediately waive provisions of applicable laws and regulations to give doctors hospital, all hospitals, and healthcare providers maximum flexibility to respond to the virus and care for patients. 